Oh, right, welcome back to uh, Blickling and... Oh, look at the hound. Hello, hound. As soon as I get out the door, you start bouncing. You see, it's quite early in the morning. It's about 7 o'clock. Mid-spring. I uh, already got Bob out and he's starting to do spring wheat on field one. Well, I've got quite a bit to do as well. well I've got two jobs that I really want to get done. Now, uh, one is we're going to go and get some grass. Anyway, we we might start now. So. so, welcome back to Brooklyn. This, of course, is a, it's set in Norfolk, my home county, about 30 odd miles from where I live. Is, uh, the village of Blickling and I think I need to get a bit closer than that as you see I've oh there I've swapped with the barbican and we're making a real mess of this I'm gonna slow slow everything right down if we just line up now I'm taking the mower out because the first thing I want to do is get some grass I uh, don't know how much that's going to take. I don't know if it'll tell me. Let's have a quick, a quick butchers. <laughs> so you don't mention butchers near cow. If you can help, and I don't tell you how much that'll hold. But I'm going to guess it's going to be very similar to base food. So I think we take about half a half a trail alone. Hook up the front mower. Better let me remember to lift it. And we pick up on the uh, forage wagon next. As you know, I fenced off part of the uh, of the meadow, and that's just for grass use. Now, what grass we can't feed to the cow will just go straight into the uh, Fermenting silo. I get close enough to that side. I try to park these things too well at times, you know. There we are. Um, nothing to lift there. And I better just uh, bump this up a couple of ratios. I'm not going out the front way. Now you see, we've still got 40,000. Uh, we do quite well on milk and that. so we should be on to during this winter most probably maybe before swapping that uh, tanker there out for an underground tank it's going to cost us a, a pretty penny I wonder if it's an ugly penny best not go there I think Luckily, no one comes along this road. <laughs> At least we hope they don't. Yeah, so we've got one, which is taking the spring wheat, and nine, I think, is spring barley. I'm not 100% certain, but I think that's what we're putting in there. I will have to check when Bob's done one. He'll do that. I also want to get over to the uh, greenhouses, because we do need to top those up again, which is why I swapped tractors with them again. This one uh, is a far better for messing about amongst the greenhouses. It's a lot more manoeuvrable. So I won't be taking any off this end. <coughs> what we have to do is uh, look at the weather we should get away with if we can get this done in this first period I mean, second period we should not get away with them I don't know. just suddenly lost all the forward momentum perhaps this thing needs a service Let's have a look no I've plenty of time yet 
So somewhere in there I left some gaps and I hope I've, I'm heading for a gap here. Where the fuck is that from not? If I garrot myself now, oh, there we are. We have. This is not a very big area I left. No, I was saying what else we've got to do. Uh, stop, 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 stop. What else we've got to do? It's quite simple. I've got the green houses to look at. I need, must go and uh, top those up with water and muck. Is that also a rather important part of our uh, way of life here? And we've also got a uh, weed. I was at two and four. Fields two and four. Luckily, eleven and ten ain't ready for a uh, half yet, but that won't be that long. As you see, the cricket pitch uh, that's shown the grass is ready, but only in an absolute dire emergency will I be taking any off those. They don't, certainly on the cricket pitch, they do not want a, a tractor going up and down there. We'll take a couple of Past so I'll get as close as I can here. I don't want to empty this uh, or mow all this at, at the moment. For obvious reasons. This has got to leave us, uh, got to last us a while before we can get any more. Some of these fence posts are sinking a bit. Oh, we've got half a ton of her. Uh, grass at the moment. We'll see if we can get a turn out. If it isn't enough, I don't think it's going to matter too much. They will last out until we can get on here again. As I was saying, we also need to weed both two and four. Um, depends which of us gets done first, who does that. Bob's going to be doing the seeding anyway, and I'm, I'm doing the other odd jobs. <laughs> Not too many odder than this. Now we're doing 800. Go up here until we find a bit we already mown. Oh, we should be alright. We're going to get another couple, three cuts like this off of here. Well, that's, that's completely empty. I'll see, see if we can take a ton and a half. So we've got what looks like quite a bit of uh, grass to go at. I could always take some out of the uh, car park now look. the cricket club car park which is what used to be medal 21 could always take a cut off there that, that won't come to, that won't be any problem but uh, I'm not going to take any at all uh, off the cricket pitch the last thing I want there's heavy tractors going over there. Alright. If I was to shove some balloon tires on, it might just about be possible. But you know, I think we'll get two cuts out of this at a time. We'll see how much, how well this does, actually, at the moment. If it's an... We shouldn't run out next time we have to fill up. We will. Right, I think we'll... All that here. I'm going to stop here. Lift that up, lift that up. Keep the back end going until it stops picking up, which it has now. And then find a way out. Oh, there was one there. I need to come wide a bit so I can see him a bit better. I'm trying to pick out where the wire is uh here here we are this is only a temporary arrangement until we can afford another medal once we can afford another medal uh we'll have one for grass and what the high oh, it's just take it up a ratio it's not we'll be here all day I'm going around the outside, it won't make me too much because it's not 
The grass isn't that long that the tractor's going to destroy it at the moment. But it's good practice to go around the outside rather than straight across the middle, but I do remember going through the middle when we went there. So this is another case of don't do as I do, do as I tell you. That's what I tell Bob. Oh yes, he, well, I'm thinking about it. His meeting with the solicitors for financiers and the rest of it went quite well. He's paid some more of what the uh, farm company think he, him and his father owe them. Can't really figure that out how the hell they lose the land and then owe this company money. As such as the uh, lot of you can actually afford us uh, expensive barristers and solicitors. I have lent Bob my uh, solicitor. She is uh, helping a bit. But as she said, it's too late to do much now. Everything's been signed. And I'm afraid under law it's no good saying, well, I didn't read it all before you sign it. You don't really have a leg to stand on, sadly. And what I could do, see what I'm going to do. I'm just going to turn this around, I'm going to put this mower back, and we've got to pick some of that grass up what's in front of the... Uh, in front of the trough. I think we better. I'm hoping Bob doesn't get uh, stuck this time. I have actually told him put the diffs on, put it in four wheel drive, and just uh, pray that things work. It works for me. That will do. Yes, you see, I'm doing some more reverse. You know, because if I was clever, of course, back up from here, but. Uh, so I actually want to just go. Through of what I can get to in front of the. Uh, trophy. We might as well use this to pick some of it up. I won't get it all, but that would get, uh, get quite a percentage of it. Well, and we can actually tip it in here, so we'll just shut that off for the moment. Put the brake on it. Well, we should be able to tip it in there, it's telling me, telling me we can, but apparently we can't. Oh, well, let's just try it like that. That's better. Yes, our little indicator was not working correctly. Let's see what we've actually done here. Oh, we left a little bit there. A little bit under the tractor. Ah, can't get out. That's the trial, I'm getting too fat. Well, it took it all. Oh boy, hardly touched it. I think we'd better mow the whole lot. I think we will be mowing the uh, meadow. Whether I want to or not. Well, I think we'll do the rest of that another day. What I'm going to do at the moment. Come on. What is that? I do not want our... Oh, well. We will remove you for now then. Oh, 
And I don't see why we are stuck here. Oh, this is interesting. Apparently we've got... Ah! I think we've got a problem with the handbrake. That's got to be... Let's go into Chad. Right, what we're going to do is just pick the way up and we will just go and... Let's go down and do a little bit to the... Oh, to the green roses, I you know. I think I've gone, wa gone wandering. My me, me brain doesn't always think quick enough. Lift that up. That's better. Mm -hmm. Well, we we get Chad to have a look at it. That is still under warranty, so uh, the fact that it to, the handbrake seemed to got stuck on, he he can deal with that. He's gonna have to. So I haven't paid for it all yet. Yeah, we never pay for the whole lot in one go. It usually takes a couple of years before Chad sees all the money. And I owe, I owe him enough to know that he will have to look at it. Now, we'll cut a cab so we can actually see where everything is. Oh, I better let him come in. You know, I really should sort out this uh, the cut here with, between the gearbox and the uh, mod which shows what's what on the HUD. It's very off-putting whenever you press to change the ratios and that changes. But then again, I'm never that quick on doing such things. It's one of those things I'm going to say, yeah, I really must do that. Right up to the moment I record the last episode, I'm going to probably do something about it. Just before I record the last episode. Whenever that will be. Not back a few years. I don't know, no business about yet. I thought they would have been full of business at the moment. So I'm not 100% certain I actually need the uh, weight on for this job. But I think this track is probably heavy enough to cope with the weight of the bucket. I'll use this one because this is the most nimble of all the tractors we've got by a long way. It's got a remarkably small turning circle. It's actually a lot easier to use than the old Massey we had, but then again, the Massey was cheap. But again, so this is far more handy for the other jobs we've got to do. The Massey was brilliant. Uh, just for down here, but since I decided we're going to uh, 
all our tractors are going to have to work for a living, like the little fence that is used for fertiliser and spraying the crops. This can do just for everything, asking the JCB. You see, we haven't run out of stuff yet, but I hate to have to run out here. Um, what would what it does? I'll, I'll finish off doing this. This is we got nine minutes, so we we finish off this little job. And what else has been happening in the region? Well, we haven't actually had too many problems just lately. It's a bit worrying, really. I don't like it when things are going too well. Yeah, yeah, I'm a bit of a natural worrier with things like that concerned. If things are going well, it gets me worried. Okay, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to knock it back one range. It'll be easier to manage. I believe I took two load in there so far. Yes, they were well done, I would say. If we can get a reading, there is a little gauge on the side here, if I can just read it as we go past. Oh yeah, only 30, 30% full on on muck. We're going to use up just all the muck we've got here. That's not be a bad thing, we can then buy some off the uh, of Blickling Hall. I'm going to need all I've got to do the fields. The two what we've got on um, which had winter crops in, I will, as soon as they have harvested, I'll be putting some muck on, or well, certainly on one of them will have muck, the other may not. Muck on, cultivate that in, or plow, depending on what the field looks like, and put some also, the radish down to over winter in the, on the field. And hopefully, when we come to next year, working that into the soil, we should, and I say should, have enough goodness in the soil to last us through the growing season. I think I actually ought to reset this there. Uh... No, I'll figure that out. If you may, if you're stupid enough to watch the uh, challenge series, you know, I figured out on 17 how to reset the uh, bucket height and all that on these, on the readout for the. Yeah, it took me a long time to work that out. Oh. Oh, marvellous. Didn't get it all in there, did we? <laughs> and the trouble is that's almost impossible now to pick up most of this. Well, I've got quite a bit of it, but you can see we've got almost all of it. The biggest part I've actually missed completely. Oh, I need to lift this up a bit more. That's better. Oh, so. Well, I think we've got it all now. Well, that tells me one thing we, we have got to go in here square. I'll put one in, in here rather than go back and get myself squared up on that one. Uh. Now we should be alright with that, I hope. Yeah, we're alright. 
just a little bit what's all always there, a little bit of spillage. And what I want to do is just take this down till I feel it touching the ground. there. I remember what it is. Right control J. Right now when it reads there it should be nicely in, pos in the correct position. Don't run into the water tank. Alright the time I saw it got a couple of three minutes yet I have a time of run on the uh, sound recording thing <laughs> so I know roughly how long I've been there's a one problem with the if you leave them too long it takes quite a while to, to fill them back up again and if you like me, oh, you lazy, you do tend to leave things like this a long time. Hopefully this will be the last load in this end one. If it is, I'll just hook onto the water tank and we just go and quickly fill up the water and then I'll finish the, the muck off. Well, I ain't quite, but uh, I think we're going to hook up to the water. And I'm hoping I can hook... That isn't going to make it too front end light if I hook onto the end of the weight. We'll soon find out. At least there's a four wheel uh, water tank. That's not like it's a two wheeler. Oops. Oh, we will get in the right place in a minute. Oh, let me assure you of that. Okay. Yeah, we got it. We don't look too bad. I know I tried this with the uh, old Massey. And I couldn't steer it. Come on. Now why aren't you getting in the right place? Come on. There you are. Well, we'll fill these up, and uh, whilst we fill them up, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. If you like this all, please consider leaving a like. If you're not a subscriber, feel free to subscribe. I'm always happy to have new people aboard. And I'm going to make that into a record. I think I said that before. Um, it won't be a bestseller. Any comments, questions, queries, suggestions, feel free to post them. This, of course, is Blickling on Farming Simulator 17 with Seasons and More Realistic. Now, 19, by the time you see this, 19 seasons will be out, and I'm hopefully, hopefully we'll have made a couple of family farm using seasons for 19. Just to see what it's like. But this is still the older version. Still a very good version, which I know a lot of people still play. And me for one. Right. Finish off the water. This is keep them going if I don't get round to fill the uh, the muck up. And so I don't think I'll be bringing any more muck down here. We'll see what actual we get. 
on the farm. <laughs> yeah, I haven't finished yet. All right. I think we've done just about everything there. I set out to do a little bit of everything. Next time. Next time. Now we, I think we'll finish this off. Now we could. Yes, we are. We'll finish this off. Yeah. Then we'll go and uh, sort out. Um, oh, what, oh, yeah. Sort out the. Some more graphs of the cows, or we're going to go over and weed those two fields. Anyway, with that, it never sounds cheerio for now. Cheerio.